prepare to witness the horrific rise of the next generation of evil. Based on the short story, by Stephen King, comes the nightmare like you've never seen it before. I know, it sucks. It's so hard sometimes you can hardly breathe. But I can help with your pain. Brace yourself. He who walks, he talked to me. He took care of me. So now I'm going to take care of him. Like killing all the adults. For starters. as they see Mrs. Michaels. He doesn't speak. He's allergic to all animals, sugar, gluten, seeds of any kind. Just treat him like any other kid. You do a lot of babysitting? Sometimes. She's very, um, innocent. Most people are liars. If you want me to be part of your family, then I'm gonna have to ask you to do something. I think your son is really special. I'm glad you're here. Do you like her more than mommy? Who is your mother? You don't have to pretend. You have to be a good girl. I can do that. I want more from you. Family. It's the most important thing. Okay, get in here. I don't know how you sleep with all these lights. What are you scared of? I don't see anything. Okay, monster check complete. Monsters you think are hiding under your bed. It's not real. What is this? It's the thing that comes for your kids when you're not paying attention.
you believe me? Don't you? Shift? Nope. Just you. you, you, you. She's stuck in here. Let's find her. She in here. She's gone. Shower. I just need it to be perfect. Nothing's going to be any different. It's just a baby. How big are they even, you know? This says they like to suck, swaddle, and swing. I don't need some book, Spencer. Your babies are so quiet. What's your secret? You have to stop. Trust your instincts. Great. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with her. Babies cry. It's tough. Oh, hi. Hi, Joe. You need a rest. I can take care of Ruby myself. I feel like I'm disappearing. Everyone goes through this. Don't you understand? She's killing me. You want me to believe that I'm crazy. Mother's instincts never die. No, hold on! 
open the door! She's so perfect. I know the truth. The final call to convene the mess hall for the goodbye ceremony. Let's move! Let's move! Let's move! That means you, Tommy. What's my ball, dick face? Good afternoon, campers! Good afternoon, Heather! Well, these might be our final moments together this summer at Briarbrook. The fun isn't over yet. <laughs> now, we all know the story. 42 years ago, Nurse Agatha gets kicked out of Camp Briarbrook. This eerie calm takes over the forest. Now, I know we've all been trying to bring this hag back for years. We prick our finger, hold up to the sky, and scream her name. Agatha! <laughs> Something fucking horrible has happened. If you can hear me, please meet in the mess hall. Do you think maybe the ritual thing might have caused Lauren? She's not real. That's the reason why Agatha. She would lure the children from their bunks by night collecting their blood in jars that she hung from the trees. I'm telling you, we hunt the hag. All right, screw it. Let's go. Here. Let's try not to die tonight. It's... <laughs> idea what you've done. I think I get the fucking picture! Ah! What does she want? The leg! Dad, can you tell me a scary story? Once upon a time, there was a little girl and she lived in a big house in the countryside. One dark and very creepy night. Dad? She heard a noise. There is something happening in this house. I don't know what it is, but Nana knows something about it. going to bed, so no wandering around, okay? Okay. just arrived and it's amazing. I can't believe they let us keep all the furniture. I'm having the girls over later, so I'll see you tomorrow. I still can't tell if this house is creepy or quaint. It's Cape Cod. Every place is both creepy and quaint. I'm really glad you guys are here. Amen to that. 
Yeah, my parents bought me this great place because they think I'll live here forever and they'll see me more often. The tubs were mad. All the tubs are dead and gone, and it's my place now. I can't just abide by the fact that she bought the tub house. She has to regret coming back here. They took our phone. what would happen if she came back. Wake up! So happy. Let me know if you discover anything fascinating. I can't deal with this right now. I don't think it's a dream. I think it's here. This happens. Abina. Abina. Wake up. Como era a vida de vocês antes disso tudo? Normal. Quando era normal. Minha mãe ficou meio diferente depois que meu pai... Cuida da sua vida, que eu cuido da minha! Ela meio que virou uma adolescente aos 40 e poucos anos. Mãe! A gente se afastou bastante por causa disso. Falava quando tinha que falar. Tá fácil pra você, né? Pronto. Você acha que as atitudes dela ficaram mais destrutivas com o tempo? Totalmente. A resposta para isso que vocês estão vivendo agora talvez esteja no passado. Eu não tenho ideia que língua é aquela, também não sei de onde é que ela tirou aqueles desenhos, eu nem sabia que ela desenhava. Eu quero saber o que isso quer dizer, por que ela está escrevendo essas coisas, que língua é essa?